Cue the games this. to a music, right? We're going to play a little game for you this morning. We're going to give you some numbers about a famous hiking trail, and we want you to guess what it is. All right, start with this. Okay. 2,200. That's the approximate length of the trail. Is that helping you at all? How about this? 14. That's the number of U.S. states that this trail crosses. Five. That's how many months it took our next guest to hike this trail from top to tail. All right, so the answer is, drum roll. The Appalachian Trail. Did you guess it there? We are springing into a new season with great hikes along the AT, as they call it. And uh, hiker Alex Patino is joining us with more. Thanks for being with us this morning. We really appreciate it. Um, let's first talk about how much the weather factors into deciding when and where to start your hike. Well, um, with the advent of Instagram, I was just before starting my hike, I was seeing everyone getting started and I started in early April and those that were starting in February and March, you can see that they were going through serious snow and really frigid conditions in the beginning. So I'm really glad that I started when I did in April 8th of last year, because right around the time that I got to the part where everyone was suffering, like in the Great Smokies, it was just blooming and it was beautiful. So I think I picked just the right time I to mean, get that's started. Amazing yeah. that Instagram though is how you figure that out. Right? I know. Right? Right? You, you, can, you can always right. watch the Weather Channel. We'll help yeah. you out with the weather too. Um, Alex, what was the hardest part of the hike, and did you encounter any really tough, even winter weather in April? You could you could still see snow. Uh, yeah, you could. Uh, we got hit with snow just as we were leaving Georgia, and that was pretty much the only time that it happened. So I still got at least that one touch of winter throughout the trail. Um, but um, the hardest part, I would say, is the trail itself. Unlike uh, other trails like the Pacific Crest Trail that believe in switchbacks, the AT likes to just send people straight to the top. So I think the estimate is that you summit over 400 peaks wow, on the AT, wow. so um, it's brutal. It doesn't let you just zigzag your way up. It just shoots you straight up and straight down. So, so what was the prettiest part? What was the most enjoyable part? Mm, I would have to say uh, New Hampshire and Maine, the, the very top. It saves the best for last. So I, that's the reason why I started from Georgia going northbound, because I knew that the sweetest morsel was at the end, so uh, and it definitely lived up to the hype. It was stunning. Yeah. So, would you do it again from top to bottom, <laughs> or would you recommend just you know picking us a, a part of the trail? <laughs> um, I I would definitely uh, go to the AT and do sections again. I'm not sure I can do the whole thing again, considering how many beautiful trails there are out there. I have a lot of things on my docket, so um, the AT will def I'll definitely see it again. Just. As a through hike, maybe I'll do southbound, but many years forward. And I'm assuming you were Instagramming the whole way as well. Now, is that is that part of hiking now? Is Instagramming, or do we leave the phones and just enjoy it with our eyes? Uh, it depends. Uh, for the most part, yeah, we all <laughs> uh, feel the need to let everybody know how how wonderful our life is, and also how like much we're suffering. It's um, yeah. the shot yes. and from our. Well, I'm glad you put some of the suffering on there too, Alex. <laughs> Because, you know, we all make it. I'm glad you put some of the suffering on there, too, because everyone complains that people aren't real enough on Instagram. Don't put the ugly stuff on there. So thank you for sharing those hard moments, too. Well, it sounds like he's a balance. Oh, yeah, absolutely. I would love yeah, to. Yeah, I'm sure he'd like everybody to know. Yeah, yeah. take right. a look at his, uh, his AT picture. Yeah. I'm sure it's phenomenal. All right, Alex Patino, thank you so much.